in the city of Nome. We don't have much time left in the season. We only got like five or six days left. With just under a week to turn a profit, Captain Zeke Tenoff is looking to make a change. Don't really have the heart to tell the girls that I'm not seeing much gold in the sluice box. So far this season, Zeke's partnership with Emily Rydell and her team of greenhorns <laughs> Come the on, you guys. has been big on drama. 2.8 ounces again. And short on gold. Now, Zeke has got a new plan. Rather than like start like firing people and messing everything up and telling the girls they can't dive and making them all upset and hurting their little feelings, I'm just going to get my brother from the airport. It's kind of like hurt my soul a little bit to not have any bro help. I need some bro time. I need to get my brother up here and I need to enjoy his company because otherwise I'm gonna go crazy. I'm done holding these girls' hands. Between me and my brother, we can pull down some serious hours and like turn this around. Also, my brother Gabe is really good at the ladies. He'll be able to smooth them over and manipulate them in a way that I can't really. <laughs> How's it going? Not only is Gabe a lot of fun, but Gabe is an experienced diver. He knows what he's doing when he's on the bottom, and I can trust him to put a lot of gold in the box. Honestly, like, we need to get some more gold in the sluice box, like, stat, right. dude. Okay. And I also need, like, help as kind of a buffer between me and, like, these girls. Yeah, it's nice to have somebody that I can trust out on the ice, because there hasn't really been anyone I can trust except Charlie out there. Mm -hmm. And like, <laughs> Charlie so, does really help that I'm, much I'm, diving. No, not really. I'm really glad you're here, Gabe. Yeah. Serious. It's good to be up here, man. You can't get gnome out of your soul. It just kind of wiggles its way up in there. Yeah. It's like, ah, oh, no. Ah, uh, yes. I just need a buffer between me and these ladies because I'm really tired of you. And, I'll buff and, them out for you. You gonna buff them out for me? <laughs> <laughs> At the Clark. Diver Jen Newby wraps up a four hour shift under the ice. All right, great job, man. Right on. How do you feel down there? That's awesome. Good deal, man. Right on, right on. Awesome. These are motivated, hardworking women with a real chance at succeeding up here as gold miners. But if we're going to make the kind of gold we need to make to have a successful season, we're going to need to bring in another diver. Trouble is arriving. <laughs> and Zeke brings up Gabe. Gabers! Embrace me. Wow. Oh, this is, this is great. Great news. Oh. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Right. Good. That's right. What's up? Good. 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 Okay, we're turning it into a frat house. Right? Welcome to the frat house, yeah, man. It's, really, I mean, it's all right. Yeah, I've been coming down to Nome and dredging for the past four years, so I know what good gold looks like on the bottom, and I know how to move ground. I'm a hard worker, you know, and I'll get done. Work your way along the sandbar, and then as far left as you see gold from the sandbar, too. I'm pretty confident in my ability. Me too. I work really well with Zeke. You know, he's my brother. What I want to see is a smile on his face and us being productive. It's pretty cool having a ceiling like that. I've never dove under the ice before. I keep forgetting that you've never gone ice diving before. Congratulations. Remember, regulator freeze up scan and will happen. Yeah, so any breath could very likely be your last. <laughs> I know it's not safe, but that's okay. Ice mining will never be safe. It's a trip down here. It's so clear, I'm not used to having such good viz. All right, you got maximum suction there, sir. Let's suck up some gold. I don't think he's here just because I have a bunch of ladies here. I think he's here because he wants gold. He's <laughs> pretty Wait, Gabe, are you seeing any gold? I actually just had a little chunk right in front of me. There is gold down here. Copy that. Now we're talking. Yeah. Got the what? Um, yeah, uh... 
back down think about Gabe he's like yeah I miss your tough guy he's not really here what if I gave you this thing you're really gonna sally out and come out and freak out because a little seal come and looked at you take this with you <laughs> <laughs> this is like some Poseidon <laughs> right here all right I'll get back in the dark ice hole with the 500 pound sea mammal to put money in your guys's pocket <laughs> You know, ice mining, there's a lot of inherent risk. And, and honestly, like even in summer dredging, I've never once been in a situation where I had to ditch my weight belt and do an emergency ascent. But and I won't lie, dude, I am terrified of that cute little Where is that seal? I hope Gabe can go down and put at least five or six hours on the box, like minimum. And he better not sally out if Julius the seal comes back, because it's not going to get any gold if we get scared out of the water by little seals. Oh, it was great, dude. Gabe put a lot of gold in the box. I can see the gold in the box. Now I feel like a Sally. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. After fighting through the storm and fighting off a seal. Gabe, how much do you think is in there? Probably an ounce of gold there. Maybe a little more, maybe a little less. The decision to add Gabe is looking good as gold. Oh, yeah, dude. Glad you're here. Yeah. All right. <laughs> I bet you're. Gabe's a good gold diver, and he's going to help us get the hours and the gold that we need. I hope we see gold. And he's a huge morale booster to the whole operation. Yeah, go get some gold in that box. 